Hey, what's up? Welcome back. Now, let's continue this. I want some more non-molded cheese. Or non-sleepy cheese, I suppose. Even so, we have a rat. The mission I thought I was gonna do first has been accomplished. And I'm putting it over here, since once again... Actually... I don't know which one would be the one to use it in, so... I'm gonna attempt this one first. Now we get to he either hear or see a rat fly around in a pipe. How about that? Goodbye, little rat. It's not been a pleasure. Well, thank God it's asleep. <laughs> Could you imagine the headache? Oh, well, actually, it's most likely. It most likely have like no brain cells left by now. Shadow, what was that noise? That was a rat that got splattered. Light, not this again. <laughs> the question I have is, if that has happened before, how the hell did it happen? Like, I don't think you would leave a panel open by itself. So how the hell did the rat get in? Actually, now that I think about it, rats get in however the fuck they like. So, I guess it was just a really stupid rat the last time. Can I get in here now by chance? Come on! Go on now. Shit. Nothing to see here. Okay. Okay. Maybe I need to go to where that other guy was. Maybe that's the key to this whole thing. Either way, let's go check it out. Oh, oh, I see. I guess I put it in the wrong pipe then. Because I needed to go back to over where those guys were standing. So I need another rat. I fucked up whilst trying not to fuck up, I suppose. Have some more cheesy bits. Here's some particularly potent cheese. Filthy shadow spawn. Eat it. Eat it all. <laughs> Getting some of that rage out from from before, just like, eat it. Eat it all. And that's a sleeping rat right there. The ground crawler. Just what I need. I do really like that the fact that uh, that they like let me see here. Yeah, the fact that it's kind of like it's an animation or something like that playing when you have it. That's cool. Not just like a static image, but like an actual thing that moves and such. All right, let's place you in here and see what happens. Yup, that's what I needed. <laughs> Ouch! Bump, bump. <laughs> Boop. Oh, you could even see the blood particles. What was that sound? It was a squishy sound, sort of like a rat getting squished. Again. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. Not again. Shut a damn ground crawlers. <laughs> I guess it's on us <laughs> to clean up the mess. Amen. The bloody engineer in there is not going to do it. So yeah, it's on us. <laughs> Light. Well, let's get to it. No time like the present. Ah, have a rat courtesy of Emparagon. That's a me. So let's get over there now. They, um, I'm sure they will have quite a job on their hands. I can't even imagine how it would be to, cl to clean that up. I won't. I don't want to imagine it. Cleaning up tissues, hair, blood, and all of that brain stuff and intestines and ugh. feeling kind of sick just thinking about it. Holy damn. That's quite the metalwork. Quite some engineering piece at hand. Also, 
only one engineer in here? Are you that smart? Well, I guess so. Investigate the building to learn more about the pipes. On it. Okay, so I can go down there or I can explore up here first. I want to do the latter part. Well, that went good. Totally not a waste of about two seconds. Totally not, not a waste of my life or anything. Totally fine. Yep. Whoa, quite a lot of machinery. <laughs> Looks kind of like a casino. Well, I guess this is a predecessor of the casino. The grandfather, the ancestor of the casinos. <laughs> if I strike one of these, can I win the jackpot? I wonder what will happen when I push one of these knobs. Do oh, it. Do it. That's ominous. Well, I guess not then. Oh. oh. Hello. How uh, you doing? You're not supposed to be here. This place is for engineers only. Please leave or I'll be forced to call the guards. I have a very loud voice when I'm scared. One sound and you'll be standing on the slopes of the first mountain, yelling at clouds. Goddess. <laughs> oh, no problem. I'll be quiet as a... Uh, you're from Azadir. I've seen your profile in embroideries. I never forget a nose. You're the apostle. Really? Gnosis? Apostle Out of everything in the face, You're gnosis famous. are the things you don't remember, you don't forget. Now I'm just Kian. Your turn. Ah. Either way, My you remember turn. something. What? Your name. Who are you? Ferdows. I'm Ferdows, lead engineer. I don't know. Well, what that, that explains why you are the only one what do you here. Do? Don't you know? I, I thought you would have known. You know, from back when you were. That was quite a while ago, that dude. Codes the spheres that make the engine tick. What engine? The engine that, <laughs> you, you know, the engine. There's only one engine, the one that encompasses the entire city. It's it's what all the pipes are connected to. Didn't they tell you anything when you were, you, you know, before you were? No, not at all. Assume that I know nothing. What is this engine for? The engine calculates. That's why they call it the calculating engine. <laughs> Big numbers, complex equations. And what are these numbers used for I, exactly? We, uh, my team, we give the engine instructions about how and what <laughs> to calculate. Coding. And this is called coding. I, I understood none of that. It's a, it's a giant computer. You can't be here. You're a fugitive, and and um. This is a restricted zone. That's like two things that mean you shouldn't be here, and I could probably think of more if you need me to. Well, I don't. Sword, and I'm bigger than you. <laughs> so shut up. Those are two things that count in your favor, granted. So well, at least you're smart enough to know when you do? shouldn't do anything What's too hasty. I'm, I'm really. You have already spoiled to... half the plan, so why not spoil the right. other half? Bigger and sword. As I said, it calculates. I mean, it does more than that, but that's what it was built to do. It's core functionality. It adds, subtracts, multiplies numbers, big numbers, and it does things with those numbers. Like... Yes, um, go on, I'm listening. Have you ever watched the stars in the sky at night? I'm not just... If you heard that, sorry. Sword. Of course. And you've seen how those stars move across the sky. Using a calculating engine, we can actually track those stars and predict where they're going to be in a year from now. Oh. Or a century. Or where they were That's a cool. century ago. Why are you tracking So it's stars? kind of a giant telescope well, thingy. Well, we're not. Something I like mean, that. It's, it's just an example. We're not actually tracking stars. I mean, sure, we could if we wanted to, but... We're tracking dreams. Dreams? Dreams are very complex. Which is why we need a big engine with lots of ticking parts. To How make the heck do you track dreams? And predictions. Right. So, the part about not just being a man with a sword. Assume that's all I am and start over. <laughs> Kian, are you really that Fine. dumb? Um, those pipes crisscrossing the city, they're sort of like, um, like speaking tubes. Connecting a hundred sage masters, each with his or her own field of specialty. Okay, now you're so speaking in a language that I don't like understand. A university. 
Well, I guess. Yes. Yes, this is a good comparison. A whole city filled with clever brains. The spheres pass messages. All right, now now we're on the same level again. Them. Now I understand. Yes. Kind of. We write messages and we interpret messages. We tell the individual brains what to think about, and then they do the thinking and report back to us. Now, this allows us to write ever more complex messages until finally we have the code we need, the ultimate message. That one we send to the tower. Why? And why would you because, do that? Because that's where the biggest brain of them all is located. This is the hub of the Pike Network, the engine's core, its heart, the nucleus of the meta... Well, y you understand. The fact is, this is the most advanced and scientific task anyone's ever taken on, and we're doing it. You should be proud. Why are, Why are you doing, doing it, though? It? You haven't answered that question. Well, I... Do you know? I... Shit. I don't quite know. Because we can. <laughs> Because no one else can. Because the problem. Ah, oh, that answer. Doing something because do we can. So, you don't know what it's for. That one and so many else have used. I write the instructions. I'm the um, I'm the man in the middle. Someone tells me what they need, and I tell the engine how to compute the answer. This is my job. Who knows what the engine is for? The six, probably. The prophet, certainly. Emissary Saya, I would imagine. <laughs> this is above my pay grade. Above your... I was hired to write instructions for the... How long were we gone? Spheres, Come on, Kian, questions. you have got to know something about and, this. And not to answer yours either, Mir. You really should go before someone comes. We'll both be in terrible trouble. They usually check on me all the time. I wonder why they haven't. Because I, I distracted them. Understand. Why With the help of our app. this here in Mercuria? Why not in Sadia? Because of the tower and what's below it. Vast eddies of, um, meta energies. Meta. Do you mean magic? <laughs> magic? Magic? Of course not magic. This engine is, is, is the opposite of magic. And there's a doubt the of anything and everything of magic. Everything as a deer has strived for these I believe in the fact years. that both can exist magic an and chaos science. And uncertainty. An end to superstition and irrationality. An end to magic. No. When the engine's fully operative and the programming complete, we won't need sorcerers or witchcraft anymore. We'll be able to do anything we want with science. Reshape reality. Rewrite the laws of the cosmos. Remove death and disease. Poverty. And no matter how you look at that, that's scientific magic. So it's still magic and it's both science and magic. What do dreams have to do with it? The engine feeds on the on, on the building blocks of reality, um, ideas, stories, dreams. Magic is highly detrimental to the system. See, sorcery causes chaos, injects uncertainties and, and, and fallacies into our calculations. So, is that why magicals are, are being relocated? We can't have them around. While relocated? The they calculate. really don't tell you what but to do with them, done, do they? You believe they're being relocated? Yeah, that's what yes. I was saying. Yeah, yes, of course. I mean, it's what they told us. You said yourself that wasn't. Why would they lie? That was above your pay it's grade. Simple. They're the lying. Isn't simple. Compatible with magic, and we don't want anyone getting hurt. There's no room for sorcery in Mercuria. The magicals are better off in their new homelands. They're gonna be killed. They're being sent to prison camps. Re-education camps. Uh, this is true. Yes. But only temporarily. This is their first stop. What Afterwards, do you think re-education camps are for, you idiot? Do you really believe that? What would the yeah, exactly. be re-educated to do? What would they be re-educated for? No, for doubts. That's not the truth. They're imprisoned, killed. They're taken given a new from their home and not getting another they one. They told us. They said they were. They were lying. They promised they'd be safe and happy and. Protect them. So this is why we're sending all the magicals away from Mercuria. Because of the ring a ding ding, we have a winner. I yes. Yes. That's why. I didn't know. I didn't know. There are children. Yep. There are. 
They lied to Men, us. women, children, you need infants, to name it. All magicals before starting up this calculating engine. It's already running. I'm I'm not as long as the thermaturgical interference is below the acceptable threshold for Pretend that I'm a very small and possibly very stupid child. <laughs> you mean a very grown and very stupid no. man? No, they don't they don't need to get rid of all of the magicals. Just enough not to disrupt our calculations. We'll be done instructing the network in a couple of days. After that, they can pull the lever whenever they want. That's the last component of the engine. The tower. The one that will start feeding on and molding the dreams. Changing the world for the... For the better. Yeah. For the better. That's... I, um, that's for us to judge the later. the ceremony is a few days from now. The emissary will be there, together with the first, and the prophet, and... 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 And please don't kill me. <laughs> I'm not going to kill you. You've only just told me what, what the thing it does. Not the will of the goddess. I'm not going to do that. Something is going on. Someone's. Oh shit! Yeah. I had a feeling it was you. How yeah. did you know? Goddess, what are you doing here, Hami? Where are your men? Right outside. They can be here in seconds. You, engineer. What's your name? I threatened him. He played no part in this. For Dows. I'm for Dows. Oh, he's so scared and nervous. You lied. I beg your pardon? You promised they'd be safe. I've no idea what you're talking about. Go, for Dows. This is not about you. Just remember what I told you. You're not doing the work of the goddess here. Stop the engine. Do the right thing. I should have realized the taking of Old Town was too easy. It was a distraction. Designed to take my mind off the investigation. And you Commander fell for Valon it. And the MS Aha. have been lying to me about you. Win death. for me. Why is that? Because I'm a danger to them. And it's not the only thing they've lied to you about. This engine. You betrayed us. You joined the enemy. I'm doing what's best for the world. Sire and Vermont, not to fight our people. I think. Not to fight you. Sister Sire is the emissary. Commander Vamon is your superior officer. They are your people. They are traitors, Mir. They have betrayed our nation, our faith, and... You should have come to me first, Apostle. You should have come to me. Instead, you've shamed me. You've shamed Mother Utana, the Six, the Goddess, your nation. You shamed yourselves when you began when this I project. When I received word someone had been spotted entering this house, I had a feeling it was you. I entered alone for two reasons. All right, name them. One, as a courtesy to the mother, it would break her heart again to hear that you perished in dishonor, fighting my guard. Well, then I won't. And two, your living proof that Vamon has lied to me. Ha <laughs> ha. I cannot reveal my hand to Vamon, but I also cannot let you go. You can just you'll tell them I managed now, to sneak out or something. And you'll be brought to Sadir tonight. How about if I don't? The courts will decide your fate. For the time being, while I sort out this mess, you'll be locked away under a false name. No one will know you're alive. How about so when I'm ready no. to confront the commander and the emissary with their lies? I will reveal the truth about your survival, and you will cooperate every step of the way. Ask Sire and Vermon about the camps, and what they're doing to- You lied. You lied to us. You told us they would not be harmed. You told us they'd be safe. There oh, children. <laughs> get off me, you! Good idiot. for you, dude. Go. I'm gonna help you. Go, Keon. Make them pay for this. Stop that! Get off me! I'll have you beheaded for this. I have a feeling he doesn't care right now. Shadow, damn you, man! Leave this place now! Huh? He, he actually put up quite a struggle. Oh man, did you hear all of that? Please tell me you didn't. Damn. Damn it all. Damn it all to hell. Oh, good lord. That was quite the reveal. Quite the reveal. But yeah, look at that. He uh, he was stronger than I, than I thought he would be. Yes? Mother. It's the general. He asks to speak with you. Send him in, child. 
Hami, is anything the matter? I do believe it's it Kian. is. He's alive. Oh. Surprise, surprise. Goddess. Goddess, be praised. How do you know this? We had a we little acquaintance. The engine room down on City Green. Light. What was he doing there? Speaking with one of the engineers, Fadaus, a young man from the southern provinces. Kian said... Oh, well, it's of no consequence. He's a traitor. He's joined the resistance. For a but good cause. As I suspected, we have been lied to by Vamon and the Emissary. For what reason? That I don't know. Yet. And until we do, we cannot confront the mother. I agree. I don't we think don't they're against me, but I don't think they're the fully with me, if to they be honest. Know that we know. What about Kian? Was he here? I'm fine. How did he look to you? We're just he fine. strong. Different, but strong. He must have his reasons for doing what he's doing, Hami. Kian would never betray Azadir or his faith. Perhaps, but that's what exactly. he's doing. Exactly. I'm just doing what I'm doing because what you're doing is wrong. Face righteous judgment. But he fled like a coward when the engineer attacked me. Hey, I took attacked. my chance, okay? I don't blame the man. Kian poisoned his mind with baseless lies. Baseless? My men detained ha. him. I have my I sources. him somewhere safe, somewhere he can't tell anyone what he saw and heard. Out of Vamon's reach. We need to keep this between us, or we run the risk of alerting the commander and emissary Saya. Much as I'd like to hunt down yes. Kian myself keep and quiet. get into the sword. Please, I need quiet to, Let's to act further. Let's trust to illuminate our path and bring us to the truth. I certainly hope she will. I would like to know where this goddess and light and shadow thing began. It's like that, that sort of the stuff I'm into, like knowing the reasons for stuff, you know? And I speak with the others. Um, we are gonna do that in the next session or next episode, whatever. Next episode for you, next session for me. <laughs> but yeah, we did quite a lot of stuff this time. <laughs> After I finally figured out what I needed to do. Oh boy. We have gotten our hands on a giant piece of machinery that we need to stop. Yeah. But either way, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, then be sure to let me know by smashing the like and sub button, leaving an awesome comment, and follow me on social media. Now, have a good one. And I will see you all in the next episode. See you later. Alright, that's gonna be it for now. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then be sure to let me know by smashing the like and sub button, leaving an awesome comment, and follow me on social media. Now have a good one, and I'll see you later. <laughs>